Hello everyone and welcome to Age of Empires. This game, man, I haven't played Age of Empires before, but I know it's been a while since people really liked Age of Empires and a new one came out and this is quite hotly anticipated. Is that a phrase? Um, so I thought I'd upload myself doing at least the Normans campaign. Why not? I'd like to do the rest of them if anybody cares to watch. Um, I mean, I will play them for jerseys. Jerseys, I just don't know if it'll go on the channel. I hope so. Um, I'm not good. I have played some StarCraft, so I'm not complete garbage. I know how to do some things. But I, I, I'm not amazing. Let's be clear about that fact. Anyway, this game is on Game Pass, so uh, if you have Game Pass, it's freaking free to play this cool game. So you should do that, because that's cool. So let's get into it. I'm kind of super interested in how it starts because it's 1066, which is when William of Normandy unites all of England. So our, our idea is to take England from our Anglo-Saxon rival, also in England. I wanted to just start with like the Mongol campaign. Uh, I didn't realize that you have to unlock it by completing two missions in the in the previous campaign. Oh no, you can do it right. You just have to do two missions in Normans and then you can do whatever campaign you feel like. So maybe we'll do Moscow after this. Or, uh, Mongol. Let's, let's start the mission. Let's do it. Uh, oh man, do I want to... Not new to real-time strategy. Man, we gotta do this, huh? How it's meant to be played. <laughs> yeah, okay. Fine. Multiple simultaneous attacks and stuff. Man, I'm gonna lose. Are you ready for me to freaking get my... Wow, poop turned inside out. It's gonna happen. Well, this looks really cool. Wow. Some events leave a deep mark on history, but none on the land. This is the site of the Battle of Hastings. After oh, that's almost cool. a thousand years, no traces of the bloody conflict can be seen. But here. The fate of England turned. It's where a king this is was cool. killed, and his victor claimed the throne. I actually went out there to get that footage. That's really awesome. October 14th, 1066. We know what happened here on this day, thanks to this. Man, I'm getting a history, history. lesson. Carefully preserved illustrated record of events. It shows the main players Harold, the newly crowned Anglo Saxon King of England, and his challenger, William, Duke of Normandy. William claimed the previous king had promised him the crown. So he assembled an army and prepared to sail to England to fight King Harold for the throne. But a storm thwarted his plans. Meanwhile, Harold discovered that a Viking invasion had landed in the north. Another threat to his crown. So he raced to fight them. Oh. Direct in Harold. France, Man, I did not know this William much. waited for the right conditions to sail across the channel to England. The weather cleared. He seized his chance. How beautiful that coast. 250 miles north, Harold had defeated the Vikings. Now, hearing of William's arrival, his army sped south. Gave him time to At land. Nine o'clock in the morning. On this hill, William's Norman army were ready to do battle with Harold's Anglo-Saxon men. The stage was set, and up for grabs, England itself. What a cool freaking intro. Do all the campaigns have a cool video like that? I hope so. William of Normandy began his conquest of England, but to end this Anglo-Saxon rule, he would first have to kill their king. 
Nice. All right. So I have watched some bits of Age of Empires 4. I know some basics. I knew that Spearman countered Horsemen. Uh, leader units with special abilities. Okay, cool. Do I have? Do I actually have access to William of Normandy himself? Can he do things? Probably not, right? Because if I let him die, it makes no sense. Maybe. On October 14th, 1066, William of Normandy stood ready for battle at the base of a hill. The high ground belonged to King Harold of England and right, his Anglo-Saxon army. Here, on this hilltop, the fate of England would be decided. All right, so all I gotta do is just select everybody, huh? Oh, I'm only the blue. All right, these guys will just do what they will, huh? All right. Him and, yeah, this is Duke William. Do you guys don't have any abilities? It looks like rallies nearby allies to increase attack speed and melee attack speed. All right. I don't know how long this cooldown is? But do it. An attack. What is this formation you guys chose to do? All right. Whatever. These four horsemen by themselves. Launching a direct assault on the shield wall. Yeah. I feel like such a strategic genius. We have archers and they don't have that many. I would have started shooting first and had them try to come down to us. Or at least move their archers up. William's army fought fiercely against the shield wall. It would not yield. As one man fell, another took his place. Yeah, they're 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 invincible. They're taking no damage. Made for a near impenetrable barrier. My goodness. Realizing his army could not break the shield wall, William called for a retreat. All right, retreat, everyone. Retreat. William's feigned retreat was working. The Anglo-Saxon army broke their shield wall formation, leaving gaps for William to make a move. Attack. Back. You. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he, he just has a lot of health. Get him. Get him. With Harold's men no longer in shield wall formation, William could pick them off as they charged. I used my attack speed. Kill the Saxons from the shield wall. I like how these ones just aren't helping. Thank you, Saxons, you freaking idiots. And these guys. I guess fair enough. We also have dudes not helping. Alright guys, can we kill them? Please? Look at that guy. Go get him. What are you doing? Fight! Rows of spearmen to push back the invaders. But William had an answer. His sharp-eyed archers. My archers! Go get them! They're so sharp-eyed. Archers can attack units at range, but are vulnerable to melee attacks. I already, I already pressed A and left click. More Norman men at arms reinforced uh -oh. William's army. There are more. We have more too. Go! Go! William has fallen. William is back! Alright, William. William, be careful. William, please. Anglo Saxon archers joined the fray, and the Normans' deadly cavalry oh. ready to charge. Charge! What are you doing? You William's lazy piece of crap. I know you're almost dead, but whatever. The enemy spearmen. Shoot. Those sturdy pole arms oh, could done. easily bring down a horse. Uh, don't send any spearmen to allow cavalry on the field. Alright, well, I'm, I'm trying. They're taking a long time to die. There we go. The spearmen are dead. Cavalry! Williams cavalry was get these archers. The Anglo-Saxon archers. Get them. This is this is a cool scripted battle. Usually scripted battles are really lame, but the fact that it's historical and I'm sure it didn't happen exactly like this, but the Anglo-Saxon army was in disarray. 
Their shield wall had been neutralized and their numbers were dwindling. Now the only thing standing between William and victory was King Harold himself. King Harold, everybody! Kill, kill that one! Yes! Look how many arrows are going into King Harold! Prepared to lay down their lives. It doesn't matter. I have archers. You're so dead. You did it. The Anglo-Saxon King Harold had fallen. Have more. One more. In the confusion, some loyal soldiers fought to the death, while others scattered in panic. Yeah, run away, punks. So many archers. Yeah, run away, your king is dead. Leaderless and defeated, the last of the Anglo-Saxon army fled for their lives. Heck yeah, they the did. The Normans celebrated victory Heck yeah. for the English king. But William's quest to rule England was just beginning. Ah. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. The well, Saxon king was dead. William's fight to rule England was far from over. All right, I didn't die in the first mission. We'll take it. I mean, it's pretty much unlosable. Like, I'm... I'm <laughs> you have infinite units, and your king, your duke, can't actually die. He just lives forever, so... say that was unlosable. But I still didn't lose. At the Battle of Hastings... The death of one man changed the course of history. The Anglo-Saxon King Harold was killed here, on England's south coast. His army defeated by William of Normandy. Anglo-Saxon rule was over forever. Forever. At Westminster Abbey on Christmas Day 1066, William was crowned the first Norman King of England. Now he had to secure power across the country. He began by stamping his mark on the landscape, building cathedrals and castles at strategic locations. All right. This is so Nothing cool. Like them had been seen I can't believe we have like before. real images of the real world. They Few games do this. The Anglo-Saxon population, exactly who was in charge. But not all were content with living under Norman rule. Anglo-Saxon revolts broke out across the country. King William acted quickly to crush these rebellions. But there was one region where dissent was spiraling out of control. The north of England. In 1069, a group of lords from Northumbria formed an alliance with Viking invaders. Together they approached Norman held York. And this reminds me of Crusaders Kings 3. It just feels like I'm playing that game. Cathedral, still protected by ancient Roman walls. But the walls couldn't save York. The city and the castle fell to the rebels. William's new kingdom was under threat. He had to get the city back under Norman control. William had no choice but to order his men north. But as the Norman forces set off on their long march towards York, how much resistance from the rebels would they encounter? Interesting. This is the mission we're trying to get to York. King William's army faced an uncertain arc fraught with resistance from those opposed to Norman rule. Okay. That's you know, how they go from black and gold colors and faded out at the end. All right, this game. This game has a cool campaign. I gotta be honest. Dude, I, I can't wait to play as like the Mongols. I think they're so cool, man. Even if, you know, they, they did a lot of killing and other worse things. Uh, their army is cool. 
road to York. William the Conqueror marched north with his army of Normans determined to take back the rebel-held city of York. But in his path stood rebel towns that harbored William's northern enemies. He would take right. the towns back by force. Little Thorpe. Let's make the horses hockey number one. Make the dudes. And, uh, I think the archers number three, I guess. And we'll make the spearmen number two. Alright, go. The scout! Kill the scout! Oh, the scout's too fast. Darn it. Scout has reaction time. But oh, you are so dead, my dude. Pretty. Spread out my forces a little bit. Cavalry first! I have nothing to stop my cavalry. Nothing at all. There's no spear dudes. Alright. A move! A move! I know how to play StarCraft, kind of! Uh, I know what you do, you hit the select all army hockey and then you A move! We have to kill these dudes, man. Come on. Still have my attack speed buff. What are you doing? Go over here. Fight these jerks. There we go. Captured. The Normans captured the town of Middlethorpe, establishing their presence in the north. Go With this villagers. To his army soon arriving, William would need more resources to supply them. Oh, we're saving. Uh oh. No, horsemen. Why? Because I told you to. Don't tell me that. Alright, do I have workers? I do. Alright, workers. Workers, go. What do I need? I need farms? Alright, farms it is. I don't have a mill, though. Build a mill. Good point. Additional farm? Alright, there we go. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. On hockey number four, we gotta make some villagers. Because this many villagers is not enough. Finit! 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 Hurry up! Alright, you are gonna build. Umber camp? Or. Go chop up some wood. These villagers are getting wood or uh, food. I guess I should. Chop, go chop some wood. Sure, one villager farms, I think. I think there's. Two. Oh, this this person's in the corner. All right. Now we're just building some stuff. We don't need scouts. We don't need like that. Workers. What are you doing? I told you to chop wood after. You jerk. And apparently I need to build houses even though I have 90 supply. That makes no sense for me. Okay. Whatever. One of you one of you can come start building houses. Escolto. On the mounts. One of you. Escolto. Just a one. Alright, let's have enough? I need 50 woods. Darn it! People just cost food. Okay. Needs food. Chopping eh. wood. Start making a house. Uh, yeah, I mean, this is, this is early game for you. I mean, shh. Hold on. Man, these villagers take forever. Three seconds, it feels like two millennium. I just want to kill some things some more. But you got to teach me how to build stuff. I know how to build houses. There you go, there's a house. I'm building a house. Are you happy now?
plus sign mean? I don't know what that is. Go barrel. Passing. Oh shoot! They're fighting. The Norman army was now well supplied by a town, but it would take a sustained effort to keep the army at full strength. True. So, reinforcements have arrived from. Oh, holy crap! Those are some reinforcements indeed. Jeez, Louise. Get over there. Another rebel town, Fulford, are added to one. stood in defiance to William's rule. Desert. Added to three. You guys are added to two. There we go. I don't even think I need to really hockey these because I feel like the game's going to make it a lot easier. All right, I don't have to build anymore. I could just go kill him. Do it. Hey. Right. They're like trying to get in formation. Bust also moving. It's a little bit awkward. Oh, you jerks. Oh, my poor scouts. Scouts, tank! That's what you're good for, right? Is tanking? That's what scouts are for? You are so dead. Why would you fight? Why would you even try? I guess because I had horsemen and you weren't going to be able to run away. Alrighty. My dudes are getting in the way of my horses. There you go. Now let's fight. Go up there. Fight. I'm going to build some more workers just because I can. Ball. Yes. Kill the ball. They don't have spearmen. Duke. Use your attack speed ability. Everybody has more attack speed. Look at these guys, what do they have? They have increased attack speed from their castles. How dare they? Only I am allowed to have extra attack speed. William the Conqueror will defeat you. You are but wee babes compared to me. Getting so much wood right now. Do. I'm build some freaking some farms. Yay! They're dead. With the Fulford rebels eliminated, William was one step closer to York. Oh, I have more workers. They won't let me select them. They're saving. All right. What do you want? Build up support. Knowing right, he would face what exactly? strong resistance in the city, William prepared to bolster his cavalry. Construct a landmark. Can I do that now? Do I have enough? Build a stable. All right, you guys. There's some gold. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Guys, need a mining camp. Help out. I thought I told you to help out. Jeez, Louise. Get to work, you lazy, lazy villagers. You can build some more workers, too. Have them. Oh, mine. Give me some more gold. There we go. Archers at 100% speed here all. The archer producing one. Put it there. I don't. Do I need gold or can I just take these dudes? Do this and then go back to your food. You too. You also help build. Hurry up. I can't build a stable until you guys are done. Danish raiders. The came under attack from a new enemy. The Danes. Danes? 
All right, you guys took a bad fight. I gotta be honest. Yeah, I think I, uh, I think I can. Look at this zip progress bar go up so fast. And uh, you guys don't get to run away. Kill them! Williams Kill them all! Held back the Danes attack, but they threatened to return unless William paid them in gold. In gold? Are you kidding me? Are you guys? All right, 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 let's build a freaking stable, dudes. Then gold or destroy the Dane camp. I know which one I'm gonna do. Dane camp is going down. Put some more archers now. Ooh, reinforcements. Down to that. All right. Stable. Build horses. So many horses. Be on hockey five. All right. And oh, you guys are coming. Should I build the Danes now, or should I wait for my uh, reinforcements over here? You guys are so slow, dude. Come on, I want to go kill the Danes. Perfect. Oh shoot, guys, you idiots! Charge! Build. Eat here. There you go. How about with that? Go. Up fight. Now it is time. It's time to go take down the Danes. We have enough dudes now. For sure, This formation. How pretty. I love the way that units auto uh, make their formations in this game. The Normans discovered the source of the Danes' threat. An outpost on the water. William had a choice. Bypass the encampment, destroy it, or pay the Danes the gold they demanded. There we go. We have quite the choke here. We have archers doing so much damage while they do nothing. <laughs> Guys, attack this wall. Or the tower. Whatever. And there you go. Or the wall. There you go. Alright, I should be reinforcing. My hockey is not working. Why is this not on a hockey? I thought I put that... Oh, I put it on five. That's why. That's why it's not working. I thought I put it on six. Uh, you guys can go get some food, I guess. There's more farms. I kill them yet? Oh my gosh, you guys. Come on. All right, increase the attack speed. Go. Murder them. Yes, we broke in. Murder the Danes. Can we take it for our own? Oh no, we just destroy it. Okay. Destroy the Danes. Ooh, what's this? First man. Come, come get this. First man. Hey, come get this. Oh, it's gold. Oh. Beautiful. All right. Let's just watch the destruction. Look at all the torches. Last one. Oh, nice. Achievement. Let's go. Yeah, we did. Nice. All right. That feels good. All that remained was to enter York and destroy its keep. It's so much gold. You guys can all like farm or some garbage. I don't know. Something else. Oh, I forgot that I have you too. I should be making some. There you go. I got 
Making horsemen, I'm making archers. Select a barracks to produce infantry units. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine, I'll make a barracks too if you want. Whatever. And you guys can come and... I don't know. Stone. Yeah, go get some stone. Why not? Alright. Is it time? My army tough enough? I think it's pretty darn good. What are you guys doing up there? Need a rally. We get added to two. Maybe I should build a uh, mining camp here for you guys, huh? Alright. This is a big army. Let's freaking go. Alright, York, we're coming for you. Get the horses at the front. Dudes in the middle. All right, charge! What is this? Tell it. Let's go to the next target. Oh, these spearmen. There we go, there we go. You didn't take down a single one. There's something over here. There's some free space. I doubt it. I, well, it looks like there's something on the map. Over here? Maybe? Maybe? Bold? All right, well, I don't really care. There we go. Do that. And then, uh, uh you, you go and help. What? They, they reinforced this position. You're not allowed to do that. This is a video game. Also, it would be stupid if you did that in real life, so I don't know why you did that. That was... Alright, it is time. Take him down. Go! Take down the city gate. There we go, shoot their archers. There we go. Breach the gates. Go. The Norman army poured into York and began sacking the town as they bore down on the keep. Destroy the keep, all right. Oh shoot, wait a second. Oh, whoa, 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 Do I have dudes here? I have one dude. Oh, fudge. Fudge. Make archers! Send them- Oh! Frickin'. Uh-oh. Alright, this might be bad. Make horsemen! Oh, they're just running away from the town center. That guy just died. Oh my gosh. Go, Archer! Alright, everybody, everybody get in! Everybody get in! Oh shoot, we're fighting up here too! Okay, 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 you guys, you guys, you guys are a little overzealous, I must say. That's a lot of dudes. I am not winning this fight. All right, we're gonna we're gonna take this fight here, and and then we're gonna retreat. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go back. All right, you guys, we're going all the way back. Get this guy. All right, I guess I should have built up more of an army, huh? I guess that's something I should have done. I have like upgrades? Like not really, just these upgrades. 
Oh yeah, I forgot about this. We built men at arms here. Dude, what? Dude, w William, William, you freaking dumb dumb dude. Oh my gosh, I sent you back. Don't pretend like I didn't. All of you. More archers. Do I have two mining? I have two mining camps right beside each other right here. That's awesome. Okay. Totally necessary. Completely and totally smart. Very, very good. Make another stable, because I need some more dudes. A few moments later. And versus 22, yeah. Alright. I think we're ready. You think we're ready? Because I think we're ready. I think it is time. Take them down. And I'll just queue up some dudes so that I'm getting reinforcements. Oh, I don't have any dudes to queue up, it seems. Alright. Let's go. Hey, you guys, the bridge is over here. Please. Please, people. There's a road you could have taken instead of going through the woods. Come on. I know there's a lot of you, okay? But you can fit. I promise. Oh, dude, this one guy. What an idiot. Oh, he got trapped. All right, line up again before we charge once more with my many, many arrows. Okay, you wanna you wanna create a, an attack force? I'll take you on outside of the range of your archers. Yeah, sure. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. All right, now fight, archers. Get over here. Take down their spearmen. Yes, charge. Go. Wait, are you really? Stop attacking the wall. Yes. Oh my gosh, please. I should have put on this attack speed thing faster. All right, reinforcements. Go, fight. Oh my gosh, I'm down to freaking archers. Go, kill their dudes. Oh my gosh, I have so many archers. Dude, what are these archers doing? Go, stop, 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 stop. Go, go fight the actual dudes that are trying to kill you, please. The love of all that is holy, I beg you. All right, this is normally a bad formation to be in because it shows they have more units if you're in a concave like this, or a convex actually. But uh, it worked out, I guess. All right, just just kill the keep. All right, fine. You guys, you guys come over here and just dumb archers. There we go. I think we finally did it. It was not a you know a dominant victory, but it was a victory nonetheless. Look at these villagers trying to shoot us with arrows. Get out of here, you jerks. You can't, you can't beat us. We're too good. Increased attack speed. Reinforcements. Go. Wait, you, you guys are dumb. Please. This, yeah, their reinforcements are not coming as quickly as they need to. We're done. Ah, easy peasy. That wasn't at all like I lost an entire army or anything. Nice. Okay. And who knew retaking England would be so easy? The Norman army and York was secured. The Northern Rebellion was over, and William the Conqueror was uncontested as King of England. Hey, stupid Anglo-Saxons.
Victory! King William took back the stronghold of York and tightened his grip around the north. Got a reward? What's this? This reward I got. I don't know what it is, but I'm level 8. Whatever that means. But if I quit, can I do other campaigns now? That's what I want to know. Let's see. Let's, let's check that out. Yes, I can. Interesting. Now I'm like invested though, so I kind of want to continue Nor the Normans. I have these ones. 1223. 1351. Alright, it is not in chronological order. This is so cool. I'm liking this game. I want to play some more like right away. Um, but I have been recording for a while, so maybe I should end this first episode. Uh, if you liked it, let me know. If you want me to play any of these three campaigns, let me know, and maybe I'll do that instead of finishing Norman's right up away. Or maybe I'll finish Norman and then get to the one that you recommend. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Depends. If you guys really want it, hit that like button and comment. Thumbs up comments and stuff. And You know, if I, if I get interactions on my YouTube videos, I'll be a very happy person. So I'm just saying things to hopefully get you to do something like... I don't know. Comments are my favorite. You don't even have to like the video. I just like to talk with people that watch my videos. I think it's so cool. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. My name is Compecky. And I hope you have a dandy day.